I think it's just a bottle cap. I could be wrong. You guys see that? You see that? Oh, please be good. We got a ring. guys alex and i are just sneaking over here real quick to a little park we are in newport harbor i think you got a nickel already right here possibly pool tab solid nickel oh look at that what's that uh, no, but a lot of people bring stuff into that water. Got a nickel right off the bat. Sounds like a quarter. Keep missing it. Okay, it's out. In the scoop. And there is a crusty red quarter. Okay. I can tell this beach hasn't been hit in a long, long time. I know I haven't hit it in a long, long time. And that is another nickel out of that hole right there. Huh. Okay. A dime. All I need is a penny to hit the cycle. That's silver. That's how the purple sheen to it. Holy guacamole! Giant chain. Giant flipping chain. Can Holy you see anything on the ends God. on that? I don't see anything. It looked like the. Uh... I don't see anything on that chain. But oh my goodness, guys. That thing must. Oh, I think it's. Yeah, go wash it off. Holy guacamole. That, how, how many, how many? That's about. That's that's pretty heavy. I got a target right here. Maybe another dime. And it's a dime. Another target right here. And I'm hoping uh, that the music doesn't uh, give me a copyright strike or anything like that. We're trying to keep uh, noise happening right now all the way up until I can shut it off. But I got targets over here and I want you guys to see. I can actually see what I think. It's like a quarter standing on end right there. <laughs> Isn't that funny? It doesn't even sound like a quarter when it's standing on end, but I can see it right there. Sweet. Man, I'm glad we came over here. This, we're killing this. this. This whole park is its own video. Right, there's another penny. I probably hit the cycle a couple of times now. Because I think it got two or three nickels. Or it seems that way, anyway. Love the sound of quarters, don't you? Oh, maybe they will move their music. Sweet. All right. I gotta watch my back here. I don't like people on the move. See all the homeless? They're over here, they're over here. We're in Newport Beach, guys. Right in the harbor. As soon as they sh the police showed up. Isn't that, isn't that funny how uh, the, the police show up and and all the, the guys here split like 
All of a sudden, huh? Yeah, I didn't even right? I didn't even see him leave, did you? No. Hey guys, we are back to metal detecting the beach today. Coming in here at uh, Newport. Brad is supposed to be meeting us here somewhere. I got Alex right here. Irene and Andrew couldn't hey make guys. it. Uh, and hopefully we see some others. So low tides uh, in a few hours. And so where we're at is the upper jetties. And I'm gonna be working to the lower jetties and then back. Okay, you got a target right here. Like an awfully deep pull tab. That doesn't sound very good. Sounds better. Hmm. Out. Is that a nickel? Right, sweet. I found a nickel. All right, that's a good start. Ah, oh, look, it's a piece of metal. Oh, it's a piece of jewelry. It's a mummy. I found a locked mummy. That's what it looks like, locked maybe? I don't know. I found a mummy on the beach. Oh, somebody lost their mummy. I think Brad, uh, Brad just got something good. Here, let me put my equipment here. Looks really good. Cartier. Is it a Cartier? It's marked Cartier. I knew by the markings immediately that it's probably Cartier. Nice. Oh, yeah. I didn't see the mark. I didn't look for it. It should be marked 750 in there. I can see Cartier. Yeah. Something else right there. It's pretty sweet. Yes, it is. You said 18K, but. What did it ring up? Uh, nine. Here, you want to see if you can see anything? Yeah, I'll see. Really weird. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. It's got Cartier on it. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Have a good one. No, I don't see any other markings, Jeff. Yeah. So, well, let me know what you think it is. Yeah. You know, I want to know. I already found the bottle opener. Oh, well, hell yeah. <laughs> well, that didn't sound like no ring. And then my turn. Oh my. Please don't be stainless. It's light for gold. Do we see anything together? I see something right there. Stainless steel. Eh. Okay. Stainless steel ring. Right at the volleyball court. Okay, somewhere over here, I just got a high tone. There you go. Softly loud, 25. And there is a dime right there. Wait. Well, I'm just enjoying the view right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's. I can't help it if the wildlife is out. You know what I mean? That's the nice thing about living in California is the wildlife. Especially when they're wearing gold. You have to notice those things. Oh, he thought I was looking at booty. No, I was looking at the gold on her bracelet. Or on her wrist. See? He thought I was looking at booty. 
I was looking at the booty on her wrist. All gold. <laughs> hey, I got a high tone right here. Probably a quarter. Then we got a target. Six. Out. Looks like silver ring. Oh, I'd go for a silver ring. Oh, I got a coin spill. You got a coin spill? Yeah. It's got a, hopefully a ring spill. So there's something in here. No? I'm going to throw it right at you. Man. You threw it at oh, that's me. quiet now. No, you threw it at me. Sorry. You threw it at me. This is a quarter right here. All right, watch out, Alex. I I could dig that out quick. Oh. Car, you threw it at me. Oh, okay. You threw all right, it at all right. Do you need yeah. it? Oh, look at that. Right on top. <laughs> right on top. <laughs> all right. Well, I got one out of my two quarters. <laughs> you threw it at me. You have not throw it at me. All right. I got a Granny Smith, and it looks like it's in pretty good shape, still with a label on it. All right. That's my thumbnail that made that hole. Ooh, wow. All right, I got a target right here. I'm gonna try to not destroy this great apple and dig at the same time. I think it's just a bottle cap. I could be wrong. You guys see that? You see that? Oh, please be good. We got a ring. Sweet! Oh, second ring of the day. I think that's going to be stainless. Eleven. All right, holding the apple with my mouth. Mm. Mm. I think this is stainless. Right there. All right. No gold for Jim. All right, guys. I just took a scoop out of there, and I see something shiny that's not foil. You see that? Here, let me go over it. And you can see, that looks like a chain. Oh, wow, it keeps getting longer. Oh, yeah. I think I just got a gold chain. All right, we just got gold, I think. Let's take a look at that. Goldie. Even there might be something on the chain. Fourteen carat on the chain. I don't know how well you guys can see. Let's see. Fourteen. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Okay. I think I just got, well, I got gold chain anyways. I don't know about that pendant. I don't see any marks on that pendant. Okay. Any luck? Oh, oh yeah. Huh? <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was cheesy, wasn't it? <laughs> uh. 
Sweet. Well, I found one time I found 12 quarters under that pier. So oh, yeah. I find stuff underneath the pier all the time and wherever the homeless sleep. Yeah, I love that. Guy goes, Those are probably be my quarters. Hey, you just dropped your quarter. I did? Yes. How's that possible? It came out of the scoop. Oh, that must have been an additional one. You, right. you better double check over there. I have no idea. Maybe 19. Doesn't sound that good. Oh, what do we have here? It's a little pendant. I can't read it. Uh, St. Christopher Protect. Oh, sweet. I don't think it's going to be anything of value, but St. Christopher. Ooh, is that going to be good? I was happy that I uh, yeah, there you go. found an orange. You can see. What kind of ring was it? It's a sterling silver. It's pretty thick. Okay, so it should ring up as a high tone. Yeah, it should, it should be loud. Here it is, right here. No way! Got it. See it. You got it. I told you. Hey, hey, let her get it. it. Let it. <laughs> nice. So what's the lesson here? What's the lesson? Don't wear a ring to the beach. There you All go. right, you have a good one. You, you take oh, care. Oh. Good job, man. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. What'd you get? A little bling bracelet. Oh, cool. It's green. It's got green on it. Hey, that doesn't mean anything because I got green still on on gold that I found. Okay. Because, you know, 10 karat gold is only... I don't, a little bit of rust right there kind of yeah. is a dead giveaway. Yeah, it probably isn't. I didn't but, think it was anything. But some of the gold that should have been rusty is nice, so you have to wonder what really is happening yeah. there. Yeah. An anklet. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff in my finds bag. Let me put that in a better spot. Okay. You got your hands full. <laughs> All right, see you later. So we were at 17,000 steps on the other side of the pier. What do you think we are now? <laughs> I told him yesterday I walked 16 miles and then went and metal detected three different beaches after that. So my body can't even move right now. It is barely making it to the car. So guys, here's the wrap up for Newport Beach. It was a wonderful day. We all got chains, guys. Alex dug that silver chain first thing in the morning. That was fantastic seeing that thing come out of the ground. I was awfully jealous seeing that, let me tell you. And I'm so proud of him. He's doing so good, so good. Anyways, guys, lots of trash. Remember, each one of these is a dig. Every little tiny itty bitty speck of foil that I removed from the beach, and I'm glad I did because I would have never found that. You know what I mean? So, guys, I got two dollars and quarters. I got two, four, six, eight, nine dimes, four nickels, a handful of pennies. I hit the cycle at least four times. I found a St. Christopher Protects pendant. I do believe it's just a stainless steel. Uh, speaking of stainless steel, this is the first ring that I found right after Brad showed me his Cartier ring. 
all right by the way that did test out as gold and so did his chain it tested out as gold okay and this is also a stainless steel ring these are beautiful wedding rings and when they come out of the ground they take my breath away and then when i realize they're stainless you know i get you know a little sad because you know i dig a lot of garbage <laughs> and i i want more gold Believe it or not, even though I was looking at this and maybe it was just the sun, but I'll get you a close up of it. it there is a 14K stamp on this pendant, okay? As well as the chain says 14K. So I'll get you some close ups of that, guys. Okay, guys, I wanted to give you a quick behind the scenes look at my new wrap up station and my new barbecue, okay? I have gas grill on this side and a pellet smoker on this side. So it's a Pit Boss Pro Series. You can only get this one at Lowe's. And I did buy this. This is not a sponsored. It took me a while to decide what I wanted to get. And the reason I got this is because I wanted a smoker, but I also wanted the convenience of a gas grill and this does it both. But the major selling point was this. This little lever allows the smoke chamber to come into here and out that pipe. I can cold smoke on this side without the gas on. So you know what that means? I'm making my own bacon. A couple of pork bellies in there that have been cured. Applewood smoke. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be making my own bacon, guys. So I got the smoker. It's all electronic, guys. That thing I just hooked to my phone. I can set the temperature that I want. I can, uh, it's got a couple of meat probes in the bottom of this. Meat probes in the bottom. It's all digital. I'm sure I'll be showing it to you in the future. And then in there is the Pit Boss Competition Blend pellets. But when I do the, the bacon, I'll be doing an apple wood, okay? And because I did not want to do my wrap ups on this, I went ahead and ordered from Amazon a potter's bench, right? So this potter's bench is going to be the new wrap-up station. I did have to make some modifications and I'm going to make some adjustments. So some equipment that I want to keep out here, mainly the tumbler, I want to keep inside that thing, okay? So guys, up here is a wrap-up from Laguna Beach the other day. I did get four rings, one of them gold. Okay, guys, now it's time to select the winner of last week's Would You Dig It. Okay, guys, I have another Would You Dig It contest giveaway for a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select the winner in next Thursday's video. So, guys, I got an item right here. I am in Park 1, and let's take a look. Let's go to All Metal. Okay. <laughs> Go 90 degrees. If you would dig it, comment below what you think it is and you'll have a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select in next Thursday's video. Okay, guys. All right, let's dig this one up. There you go. It's that stainless steel ring. Okay, guys, now it's time to select the winner of last week's Would You Dig It? I'm going to my TubeBuddy app. I'm selecting pick a winner. Comment must contain the words stainless. Pick a winner. Lana Combs. Let's see here. That 1011 makes me think of a stainless steel ring. Well, congratulations, Lana Combs. Stainless steel ring is exactly what it is. Send me an email. You can find that in the About Me section of my channel page, and I will send you out your $25 Amazon gift card. And guys, don't get discouraged. I have another Would You Dig It contest giveaway happening right now for a $25 Amazon gift card. So let's take a look at this one. Okay, guys, I have another Would You Dig It contest giveaway for a $25 Amazon gift card happening right here. Excuse the kids that are playing in the background, but they're having fun, and that's what fun with Jim's all about, right? Anyways, guys, I am in park one. 
I'm going to be in discrimination mode. And I got a target right here. Let's go 90 degrees. Would you dig it? If you would dig it, comment below what you think it is and you'll have a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select in next Thursday's video. All right, one more time, guys. Would you dig it? I dug it. Would you dig it? You would dig it. Comment below what you think it is and you'll have a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select in next Thursday's video. And guys, if you like this video, please click like. If you'd like to see more, consider subscribing, ringing this bell, and receive all the notifications every time I release a new video. And please take a look at either one of these videos.